With great reluctance, the German parliament has voted in favor of beginning negotiations on the 86 billion euro Greek bailout deal. 49% of Germans didn't want to enter talks over the burden of relieving Greece of its 320 billion euro debt. The credit control limits on the restriction to withdraw only 60 euros per day will only be eased gradually, while the value added tax will rise from 13% to 23% in the next few days. Raising prices on everything in a country struggling with a broken infrastructure. It's basically, the European people paid off the debts of uh, the Greek debts held by these big banks, which were charging monster fees. And now they're saying, OK, they're telling the Greek people, now you have to bail out our bailout. And, and it's coming down to a massive per family uh, interest charges of, of 10 to 15 thousand dollars a year. And under Greek salaries, it's, it's impossible. They're, they're basically going to be taking all these assets. In the case of Greece, by the way, one of the big assets that they were trying to grab is uh, Greece has tremendous offshore gas resources. And at the moment, obviously, the natural gas market has, has, has collapsed. But believe me, they're going to be going after those resources. Uh, and, you know, we see in Ireland, Ireland actually has gold. Um, they're they're going to be going after those resources. Spain has resources. So basically, they're, they're draining these nations. Economist John Perkins suggested Greece turn to China's banks rather than kneel to the sovereign sucking IMF and EU monstrosity. I recently met with a, a, a minister of state of Ecuador uh, who's very savvy on these things and he said of course we'd rather borrow money from China and I said well don't you think that China's going to turn around and do the same thing? He said well we have no idea ultimately what China will do of course but what we do know is that the World Bank, the IMF, the Europeans and the US have screwed us over. And we also know that they've, they've overthrown our, our, our governments and coups throughout Latin America. They've assassinated presidents down here, including in Ecuador. The Greek people are furious. Right-wing Golden Dawn party member Ilias Casadarius tore up the bailout deal, reflecting the rising anger amongst the people of Greece who voted by 61% to reject austerity. Their wishes were ignored. The terms imposed by the Euro leaders in the all-night tug-of-war negotiations resulted in Greece surrendering much of its sovereignty to outside supervision. Legislation must be passed to cut pensions, a chokehold on collective bargaining agreements, and a continuation of spending constraints. Basically, hell on earth for the lifestyle of an average Greek citizen. Prime Minister Tsipras is now facing nothing short of a revolution. Think about it. How do you sell the death of democracy to the birthplace of democracy? The wreckage of the ship of tyranny, the ship of death, the ship of corruption, the ship of fraud, the ship that is willing to overturn our world and everything good in it because everything good in it is diametrically opposed to the hellish vision of the controllers. With cotton in their ears to the lowly voices all around them, the globalists are hastily playing their cards as the Eurozone, the demon child conceived in the back rooms of the 1955 Bilderberg meetings, spirals out of control. John Bound for Infowars.com. Alex Jones here to break down some exciting developments in the area of research concerning supplemental iodine. It's nothing less than phenomenal. I began to get into iodine a few years ago because it was helping me and my family so much get healthy and detoxify. And I used some of the mainline iodine supplements and they upset my stomach and I had some issues with it. Until I discovered a product being developed by Dr. Group, who I was already interviewing as an expert on my radio show, and I began taking the product before he actually rolled it out. You now know it as Survival Shield True Nascent Iodine that your body can really absorb. Then, about a year ago, he said, listen, if you think this is powerful, I'm going to come out with rare earth, deep earth crystals that are incredibly powerful that no one else has as a source for their iodine from between seven and 12,000 feet, literally drilled out of the ground. You put it on a hot plate, and 
it turns into the pure gas. No one else has 99.99% pure iodine. And the results that I personally have had have been life-changing. I was over 270 pounds. And with the iodine exercise and better diet, I have lost now more than 50 pounds total and I'm continuing to lose the weight. I have more energy, my libido, all this crap came out of my skin. I believe our research is conclusive. This is the best iodine out there. And I know this for a fact, nobody else has got iodine based on these pure crystals, ladies and gentlemen. This is innovating, this is trailblazing. And the best part is it helps fund Infowars.com, the radio show, the TV show, the whole media operation promoting true libertarian ideas. For a limited time, experience the ancient power of Survival Shield X2. Take advantage of this unprecedented 30% off super detox special at Infowarslife.com.